<sighs> Hello. Welcome for another tutorial from DJ Frozone. How are you? I know for that bullshit. Anyways, this is DJ Frozone checking in again for humanbeatbox.com, YouTube, and all that stuff. You know who I am. I know shit's famous. But um, this is for all the new beatboxers who always ask, can you, help, can you show me a pattern that'd be good to learn? Or what's the best pattern for a newbie to learn? And stuff like that. Like really, really simple stuff. They need help just to get started. So nothing here is going to be spectacular. It's just, just a couple basic beats that you try to get under your wing. Because once you know the basic beats, it makes all those tricky, amazing beats later. It makes them a lot easier. Ah, my bad. I'm still in my words. Been at college all day. But, um, yeah. I'm also going to have a scratch tutorial, too. But that's in the next bit, which is you're going to have to exit out of the thread. And then you have to go find whatever I named it. I'm probably going to name it DJ Frozen Scratch Tutorial. So go go find that. Not now. Not now. Later. Okay. But, um, if you're a new beatboxer, there's obviously you've read tights. It, wait, is it tight T or is it tidy like tidy, or is it tight? I don't know. The guy who does the tutorials, he's he's awesome, but I don't know how to say his name. But um, check out his tutorials for learning how to make the basic sounds. But here's a couple beats that you should all learn. First one is just a real classic one. Just takes a bass kick, which is the uh, snare of your choice, whether it be the snare. Anything like that, any type of snare you want, and then a hi hat. And a basic one goes like this. You can also switch the snare so you do like. Also, whenever you're whenever you're practicing a new beat, try doing the snares inwards and outwards because you're gonna need to learn both. So like this, there's, there's. Oh, by the way, I really suck at the inward snares. So, just saying. Another one is just a hi hat and snare one. Like that. Um, if you're doing like do like the techno sounds and make using like your throat do the I don't know if you guys can hear that. So yeah, making that making that one move. So there's a couple ones you can do for that. You have to know the um well obviously the throat bass or I forgot what it's called. Yep, I have no idea what this is called. I just know if you look in the tutorials he has it on there. It's like the deep throat bass. And then you also want the snare that goes along with that. I think it's the eight oh eight or nine oh nine, something like that. Sorry, I don't know, but check it out. Yeah, another reason to check out the tutorials. But you can do one like this. That's another good one, and um. Pretty much when you're learning, if you're having a hard time learning the really advanced beats, just stick with something really simple. Take your favorite song, and if it has like some weird patterns, like it's really fast, just do the bass on every like four counts, or however counts in a measure it has. Just Let's say it was a song, that, but it normally sounds like this. Break it up. 
Yes. And then you just get better and better. And eventually you can do the entire beat. But, um, yeah, that's all I got for right now. Uh, I'm off to go do that scratch tour. Go check that out. And if you haven't already done it, um, go to the general forum and check out the thread called Let the Battle Begin. It's amazing. This song, the replies there are great. It's just go check it out. It's awesome. It's awesome. But, um, yeah, this is DJ Frozone, humanbeatbox.com, YouTube, all that stuff. I'm out of here, you know? I'm not going to make a scratch, but check that out. Yeah, it should be cool. Uh, yeah. If you have any questions, PM me. Oh, that's right. One more thing. If you're a new beatboxer, if you're an old beatboxer, always have this. What? Oh, yeah. Peace. Wait, I don't know where the stop button is. Yep, this is embarrassing. Oh, there we go. Yeah.